are you not in the I thought you want you were gonna do an intro or something. <laughs> Hello everyone! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have my lovely mother who would like to make an entrance here. Big entrance! <laughs> this is my mom, Kim Gorman. And the Kim Gorman. The, the Kim Gorman. And today we're gonna make um, some cocktails and I thought it would be fun to test you on your knowledge of slang Millennial terms. Okay, I thought you were gonna test me on cocktails. That I can do. <laughs> no, we're gonna go through those. We're kind of do it simultaneously. I'm home for Christmas and I leave tomorrow, so I wanted to make a video. So we're gonna be making what's our favorite cocktail ever? Greyhounds. Yes. Greyhounds. We don't know what a greyhound is. It's basically vodka and grapefruit. Um, sometimes, most of the time, we usually just do that, but sometimes we add a little pizzazz to it. So. <laughs> Um, to start off, before we do that, but first, oh. I have a list here of all the terms. Okay. Don't look at it. I won't. You, you don't have your glasses on, so yeah, I, don't I can't see, see it anyway. Yeah. Look at this nice little nice setup. setup. Let me move nice this to the setup. side. Okay, I'm gonna start off with a one that I think is easy, that I think you're gonna get. Okay. Um, and I'm gonna say it, and then I can use it in a sentence if you don't. <laughs> is this yeah. like the spelling bee or something? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> then you have to spell the word. Okay. okay. Uh, shook. Shook, S-H-O-O-K? Yes. Shook. Sh Do you want me to use it in a sentence? Sure. I'm shook right now. Upset. Amazed. You, you can't believe it, it's unbelievable. Yeah, it's unbelievable, there you go. Okay. It's a, but you don't have to be upset about something. Okay. Like, okay. Yeah, so okay. It's, I'm shook. Okay, let's start the cocktail then. So... You're the shaker person. I don't really know. We need a muddler. Shaker. We need a muddler. We need a muddler? Well, don't you want a product? So basically, how did we like how did we decide to start putting basil in our drink? I worked at Tommy Bahama restaurant in Newport, and they have the basil grapefruit martini. And when we went, you got it, and we were like, that's great. You gotta tell them what you're doing. So now we are going to muddle. So but we what, wanna, do we, what do we, we usually will, use instead of regular basil? Thai basil. Thai basil but we're out is of that, so, so good. So this is, we're pressing on these leaves to get all the nice flavor from the basil. You are a mixologist, right? So anymore. this is gonna give, infuse the flavor into the drink. And then, you know, we'll also add a few leaves for Should we muddle a lime decor. in there too? Sure, why don't you cut you that? You know what, why not? That. Should I do slices or like? I don't know, just don't cut your finger off. I will try not to. Well, you're, no. This... Turn the line now, turn the line. I need it's to give okay. her a slicing lesson. <laughs> a slicing. <laughs> okay, can I just put these two sure. in there? Sure, sure. Okay, well, put them up in here. here. Up in here. Let's do a little bit more, there you go. Now so we muddling. really got the Okay, while you're muddling, muddling, do you know what the phrase, I'm dead, means? Super tired. <laughs> okay, let me use it in a sentence. Let's say, okay, oh, I'm fully cut off right here. You gotta move the camera back up. Sorry, people. We got the tall and the small. I know, that's why I was we on this side. We got the tall and the I'm small. Okay. Okay, so it's like if you said something funny and I go, I'm dead. I'm gonna say I have no idea. Uh, like if you're like, oh my god, I drank four cocktails to be before coming here and I'm so drunk right now, I'd be like, I'm dead. Like that's it's uh, like it's like an LOL uh, sentiment. Okay. Okay, right. you gotta keep on muddling. No, I already muddled it. Okay, oh. so what's the next step? Do we put ice okay, in it? And then we need to get some ice in there. You know, but are we, ice, are we are we lots of ice because you want the, when you make a drink like this, you wanna serve it really cold. Drunk. Otherwise, it just doesn't Wait, taste so are the we same. putting, this is not working, I'm gonna use my hands. Are we putting ice in the shaker and in our drinks? Or are we having like martinis? Well, if we wanna have martinis, this could be more like a martini. We could put it in either way. We I could kinda do like, you know what? It's our like this story, kind. so we could do whatever we want. It's our story. Dad, come make an appearance. Come here. We're asking mom if she knows what these slang words mean. Come in. Dad right, won't even fit in the frame. Yeah, he won't fit. Now we have another tall. <laughs> Two talls and a small. <laughs> okay. Do you guys know what cuffing season is? And I put this one because oh, it's cuffing fall. season it's right fall. now. It's fall. But what does that mean? No, it's like 
Fall and winter. Uh, when you get arrested. <laughs> <laughs> Cuffing uh, season. That would be a literal sense, maybe. But no. What are, I'll use it in a sentence like, that girl wasn't very cute, but you know, it's cuffing season. You're hard up. Hibernating? <laughs> you don't look good because it's winter and you're, I don't know, and your skin's dull. Okay, let me be more obvious. <laughs> um, I think that I'm going to ask her to be my girlfriend because it's cuffing season. Mm. Uh, we're we, we just are not. <laughs> that clears it up. Miss... Okay, cuffing season is around fall and Christmas time when it's the holidays and you start to feel lonely because everyone else has a boyfriend or girlfriend. And so you start going on dates and hitting on people you want just because you want... <laughs> what? Okay, I'm a... I don't know how to explain this. Okay, we have ice in the jar. Okay, we have ice in the jar. Now it's time for the alcohol. <laughs> how much are we putting in? Usually we don't measure, That's right? That's we just kind of eyeball it. Like we have to come up with... Something no reasonable. If we're making, how are we making two drinks, three drinks? How many? I think drinks? we should make one for dad. Then. So we're making three drinks. Yeah, okay. So that. light drink, <laughs> and just do three shots. That would be a. Let's do like four. Two shots of vodka. <laughs> Gosh, this looks like so much vodka. And to but... round out, four. four. Well, that wasn't even a full shot right there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. What's the ratio here? Because usually I just well, eyeball it. Usually you put more juice <clears throat> than alcohol, but <throat> some of us like more alcohol than juice. Okay, but... while you're doing that, do you know what securing the bag means? Okay, this is, these things are ridiculous. Securing the bag. Hey, let me use it in a sentence. Okay. Is this dirty? No, none okay. of these are dirty. Okay. Like. You've got the date. You've got them hooked. Your rent's due next month, so I gotta secure the bag. So it has to do with money. You gotta make yes. some money. Secure the bag means like let's get yeah, on. Let's get this bread. Do you do you know what that means? I know what bread let's is. Let's get this bread. Yes. Okay. Exactly same thing. Okay. So let's secure, secure the, the bag. bag. Okay. So what are we gonna do in 2020? Secure the secure bag. Secure the bag. All right. So we have all of our ice in there. Juice. So do you think I should put like... This is fresh squeezed juice. This is way. fresh squeezed grapefruit juice. I personally don't like the white grapefruit as much as the ruby red. This is much more This is more tart. sour, yeah. I like tart though. We, our whole family doesn't like sweet drinks. So grapefruit, if you don't like sweet things, is really... Is the I lost track the of how many I did, and I think right. we might need Fill more. her up. Just, should I just throw the whole sure. thing in there? Sure, okay. Yeah. I don't know why I was Then, there. pop that lid on there. Okay. Are you going to be While you're shaker? doing that, I'm going to cut some lime for the Garnish? Orange. Garnish. Ooh. Nice, Ooh, She's Haley. fancy. Let me get Dad nice. a glass. We have these glasses that have our last name initial on it with G's. So, are, we only have two of those? We might only have two. But we have some more G's in there. Right there is a G. Shake it. I'm gonna shake. And you know what? Well, before you shake, I'm gonna tell you, can you give this a full send? Do you know how to full, full send? send? Full send it? Yeah, what does that mean? Full send means put all effort in. Okay, can you use it in a sentence? Like in a very, a way that I would use it? Oh, let's see, a sentence that you would use. <laughs> Normally when I've heard you, you're playing die, die up, you're dying up, and you'll say, I'm giving this a full send, right? That is so good, yeah. So when you're about to toss in beard eye, so she's talking about I'm playing about beard to, eye. I'm, this Her thing, favorite game. This thing's going and I'm giving it a full send. <laughs> full this send, I'm glad. Okay, and full send. to throw another one in there, this video is gonna give you so much clout, mom. Cred. Like credibility, Cred? right? It's like popularity. Okay, like clout like, is like, okay. okay, like chasing clout is like doing everything you can to become famous. Is it done? Are we yeah, putting anything yeah. else in it? Do you want to try it before well, we pour it? No, let's just pour it let's and pour try it. it. Okay, do we need more ice then <clears throat> for the... Sure. We'll top it with the lime. 
and oh, voila. some voila. basil leaves. Basil leaves. Mom, do you know what it means to be snatched? That girl just, she looks snatched. I do not. Um, it could go either way. She could look wretched or she could look great. <laughs> yeah, so it's snatched is a good term. It's like, ooh, like you look snatched. You look skinny and your face looks good. You got good makeup going on, something. Snatched. Okay, all right. Shake it. Just so then, well, this has a nice little strainer in it, so we just strain Ooh, it in. Look, it's all I know. I don't know why. Leaking. I think we need to get a new one. We're so hip with our mason jar. And then, there's the lime, a leaf, wow. and a leaf. So oh, can we, we didn't need to really use a spoon on this. Can you see those beautiful drinks? Now the most important part of the entire Thing. Process? Drink them. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Let's see how they taste. Mmm. They do taste really good. Mmm. Okay, while well, you're enjoying that, I have a few more. Mmm. I think you're gonna know this one because I've used it a lot around you, and I think you've picked it up. The tea. Spill the tea. No, I haven't heard that one. Spill the tea means drink. No. Uh, spill the tea is like. Uh, like, let's say, if you spill the tea. You, tea as in what? T E A or T E A? T -E -A. Let's say you go out with your friends and a bunch of drama happens, and the next day I say, girl, you better spill the tea. So you better fess up to all the. You better tell me the, about the, the stuff drama. that went on. Yeah, the tea is like the drama. Okay. Spill the tea. The tea. Okay. Yeah, that, you make, can, that, yeah. that would make sense. I, there you go. All right, how about being left on red? Like, last night he left me on red. It was a no-go. <laughs> oh, <laughs> red as in R-E-A-D. Like red. Oh, so say it again in a sentence. <laughs> last night he left me on red. And now I'm done with him. Hmm. I'm, I'm not sure. I mean, obviously he did something to upset you. <laughs> okay. So being left <laughs> on red is when um, you can have, you have the option to leave, like, if you've seen a message or not. It'll say, like, they read it at oh, this. Oh, I get so it he now. Read, he read my message and, and left never me. responded. Never. Okay, I get it. He I left get me it. on red. Okay, I get that now. I you get that. Yeah. Okay, that's good. My dad's wow. like, what? The that's heck? actually kind of interesting. That's yeah. pretty clever. That's more clever than some of the ones that. Yeah. Okay. And then this one can be our last one. I think this is like the 2019 one that like resonated with me the most. <laughs> Not that I use it, but okay, no cap. Use it in a sentence. How do I even use this in a sentence? <laughs> this year, I'm gonna secure the bag and leave them all on red, no cap. There's no top to this thing. I'm going, this is, it's like full send. Yes, yes. <laughs> I was literally just gonna say yes. So it's like no cap is like, I'm not lying. Like they're like, I'm going in. Okay. Which one do you think you would actually use? Well, I've always liked full send, but I'm really starting to like this. He left me on red. They left me on red. I like it. Yeah, so like when your friends don't respond to you and you're like, let's get together tonight, you're like, ah, oh, they left me on red. So I could say that a lot when I'm texting your brother. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, text mom back. All right, well, we have to go to dinner. Dad, come drink your cocktail. Come taste. Oh, God. I'll bring it to you. <clears throat> Thank you for answering all those questions, mother. <laughs> you're welcome. Papi? Provecho. Oh, really? Yeah. Give me a slurp. Oh, delicioso. <laughs> All right. Grazie, prego. Thank you Grazie. for watching. Thanks, Mom, Thank for you. guest starring in this video. Thank you for having me. Many more videos to come in 2020. Pleasure. Don't Peace leave out. people on red. Full Peace send. Out. 2020. <laughs> Happy New Year. <laughs>